Happy Thursday, everybody! Why you gotta be so extra with everything? Because you've been keeping me out the videos, but you know I have to say, where's all of my gym stars? What's up, everybody? It's your girl, Bree Easy, aka Fresh from the Salon, BKA the People's Champion. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Here's a Goku gym shirt. I was trying to hate on you a little bit. Oh, okay. So hopefully everybody's been doing well, and and you know we got one more day till it's Friday. So let's get into it. So you remember like growing up, and if you got brothers and sisters, and your mom would be like, uh, y'all stop all that wrestling in there. Stop jumping on the bed. Stay off my couch. Yeah. This ain't wrestling. Well, obviously, we listen. To a certain extent, because that entire time, you know what we were doing? Yeah. Perfecting our craft so we can make videos like this. Again, but y'all already know. If y'all know Lord Adrian and them guys, man, hey, look, man, it's dope as hell that these guys have parlayed, you know, they started out just wrestling, just fighting, just fighting like hell. And then they done changed this thing into... Bro, they, they now making getting, money. They making money off of it because this is a this is literally a paid <laughs> advertisement. So honing your craft for no damn reason. Actually, bro, these dudes are professionals, dog. Like this, this don't this is crazy. It is crazy because, like I like, said, where did he go? This is all the things we were told not to do right. growing up. Bro, why are you on top of the Nissan sign? This is when I knew that this was a paid advertisement. You know, if the mat didn't give it away, but it's all, <laughs> but it's all good though, man. These dudes be coning their crap and all this stuff, man, bro. If you, ah, big splash! Now I had to watch this several times because before I knew this is like what they do for you know the right. Atlanta water. I'm like, oh my goodness, he done broke this dude's leg. Oh my lord, he choked, slammed him straight to hell. Oh my lord. What? That's how Jim Ross said it, that's man. How you, that's how you used to. Well, you know what? You're the only boy, so who did you wrestle with? Uh, just people in the neighborhood. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. I ain't had nobody else to wrestle yeah. with. What were some of y'all uh, favorite wrestling moves doing as a kid that y'all like to do when your mama said stop playing? Were y'all jumping off the bed or having a chair jumping onto the bed or jumping from couch to couch? We used to jump couch to couch. We used to jump couch to couch <laughs> and jump off the couch. And we were like, mama and them were leaving yes. and we'll put a mat you put on all the floor. The you took yeah, all the yeah, yeah. off the and put them on the floor. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, what else we got? So, okay, so you know, guys, this is kind of on a little serious tip thing. But, you know, everybody's, like, freaking out about the entire coronavirus stores are being sold out of, uh, like, you know, the mask, this hand sanitizer, soap, bleach. Now, why wasn't all these things being sold out before the coronavirus? Were you guys not washing your hands? Y'all wasn't washing your damn hands. I got that Yoda meme that, like, why is all this stuff sold out now? What the hell was y'all doing before? You and you know how people, you know how like at work, this yeah. is how work people wash their hands. You ever been in the bathroom and they go wash their hands and they put their fingertips. Bro, no. Ain't no. So you're supposed to be laddering up. You gotta get the back side, the front side, the inside, the in between the fingers Bro, tips. a virus. They do this, put it underneath the water. Why is a first world country afraid of a virus that can be stopped by simply washing your hands and your ass. Dude, the, these, and all these are essential things you should have in your house anyway. Stuff that you got, and then they talking about, like you said, the people were talking about like, you, they don't, um, they sand, hand sanitizer and soap and all this stuff. Bro, I don't know no households that I know of that don't got a year supply of that shit in their, in, in their back room right now. And when I'm talking about a year supply, I'm talking about three things of bottle. Y'all know that damn bottle soap lasts forever. If you got three things of bottle soap and three things of hand sanitizer, that's that's a year supply yeah. right now. Yeah. So we ready. Like, it can be killed by just washing your hands, your ass, and practicing and regular if, and hygiene. And everybody got bleach. You got bleach. Everybody got bleach. But well, everybody mama know how to pour a cap of bleach. Tell you, baby, pour a cap of that bleach into the into the dish water yeah. real quick. And then that, that clean your hands and keep them firm. And you got and, my mom. Uh, uh, you uh, got uh, this soap. Yeah, and then the one more thing I was going to say, like, even if you ain't got the brand name Clorox, you got the, the Dollar Tree brand yeah, uh, yeah, Purex, white or bright. Whatever, or whatever <laughs> they call it. It still works. It's like 1% bleach. That, that's all you need. But hey, yeah. it is what it is. I don't shake everybody's hand anyway. I doubt I doubt like this right here. You, you, like like that. I don't oh, even do I don't even do fist to fist. I do like this. I'd be like like that right there. 
Yeah. Like when I go in the gym, this is what you see me do like this, and then yeah, side of the fist. Oh. Yeah. Oh, and okay. then like, and I definitely don't touch my face or anything after I come from the gym. And you know, we sanitize everything when yeah. we're in the gym anyway. Yeah, before so, and after we use right, it. Right. It, it, it shouldn't be. It just boggles my mind why people like we worried about what happened when you catch it. Mm -hmm. I'm looking at it like HIV or something like that. You take I'm, I'm concentrating measures. on. I'm coming concentrating on not getting it. Right. If if you're doing you know. the basics, then you should be. Good. Yeah. Like obviously, just they say it's it's hell once you get it, but I'm just like, bro. It's so easy not to get. I don't know, but you know what thing? I think I was telling you this last night, and then uh, I'm out. But I would like to see one person that had it, and like I'm good now. Yeah, we haven't, but we seen haven't had people, we haven't seen that yet. So they quarantined I, I, them all. Yeah, but you know, like the time frame on, like okay, nothing's been narrowed down yet. Right, you right, right. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. But I don't know. All that's interesting. But anyway, it's your girl Bree Easy, aka Fresh from the Salon, BK the Peeps Ten Back. Don't forget to hit the like and the subscribe button. And right now, what did you used to do when you jumping off couches on the bed? Did you take all the pillows off your mama couch and put it on the floor? And I knew you was gonna do that. <laughs> get out my seat. What's it getting out my seat? All right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what it is, man. Hey, look, man, if anybody got anything like that, man, like you got that corona, look, I hope ain't none of us got it right there. Wash your hands, wash your face, wash your ass, and you should be straight. Hopefully, we're able to eradicate this virus just like we pretty much all but eradicated HIV, uh, Ebola, and all of that stuff. So, you know, hey, you can live with all them things now, man. So, it, hey, it is what it is. Hopefully, we get to keep on rolling and it don't become an epidemic, a pandemic, or anything like that, man. But look, live and direct, man. Check it out, man. This is what we got for y'all today. NBA 2K20 is now free on Xbox. You get the game for, right, for free on Xbox. If you have Game Pass, this game is absolutely free. There it is, NBA 2K20. I have Game Pass, plus you get Ori and the Blind Forest and uh, State of Decay 2. I might actually play State of Decay 2, man, but look, the game is free. Get it for free on Xbox right now. Come out there, make your character, don't put no VC on it, and let me bust your ass, because that's what I'm trying to do, man. I ain't trying to have no hard games while I'm over there, man. I'm trying to have all easy games while I'm on Xbox. But like I said, bro, do what you gotta do. Look at me in the corner. Trays up, splash down, legend. I mean, hey, look, what I wanna tell y'all is, right now, this might be, if you're a 2K content creator, this might be the best time, man. Look, last time the game was free, a whole lot of people took off. So if you're a content creator, hey, do your thing, shout it, do your thing. I mean, hey, it's time for tutorial videos, jump shot videos, best build videos. I'm spamming them hoes, damn it. I'm about to spam the videos. And you know why? Because LJ need a new pair of shoes. Somebody gotta pay the bills. Damn sure ain't YouTube. So y'all already know what it is. But anyway, man, like I said, it's awesome that the game is uh, on Game Pass. I don't know what the criteria is to get on Game Pass. I don't know how much a company has to do, pay somebody to get on Game Pass. I don't know why 2K is doing it. Why do y'all think they're doing it? Do y'all think they're doing it just because uh, Microsoft offered them that good of a deal? Or do you feel like that the numbers from 2K this year are so down that they're doing anything to bolster the numbers. Because like we said, we saw that the numbers were down at the beginning of the year. They, they began giving the game away for free. And then, so this would be like the second time they're giving it away for free. They gave, they did the chalk pack. They did the shake pack, all that stuff. So they've done a whole lot of things to try to help, you know, bolster this game's numbers. And uh, do you think that, that putting it on, putting it free on Game Pass? Actually, you can you can get Game Pass for a dollar for like a month, and then that's enough to see if you like the game. But the thing is, do you think they're putting it free on Game Pass because of that? Because they're just trying to bolster their numbers, or do they just know that this 2K are they going with Microsoft, knowing that gaming is pretty much a service now, and with gaming being a service, you have to pretty much just comply with uh with what everybody's doing. And when when what I'm saying is. You just want to get your game out there. You're going to make the money. 2K could be free. I still would have spent $300 on it, $400. They would have made three, four $400 off of me and a lot of guys. Joe knows they probably made a million off of him with all, this, all his bills. <laughs> all his bills. Uh, Swante, um, Brother Jones, he makes a bunch of bills. Like all the people that make a lot of bills, they probably made they, they made way more money off of them. I got my boy uh, Nino. He got about 30 bills. 
like all of us that really play the game, you know, you get bored and you start making more and more bills. So they made the money. They just realized, do you think they just realized that they just need to get the game in the hands of people by any means necessary? Or do you feel like it's just, nah, nah, the game numbers are so bad. They just want to bolster the numbers and, and tout a bunch of, uh, a bunch of people playing online at once and all this stuff, man. I don't know. Y'all let me know down in the comment section what y'all think, man. Um, up next, we got my boy Shakedown. Shake, but hey, look, trays up, splash time, my boy. Shake down, man. Hey, look, man, he got this video. Hey, we gonna um, I'm gonna let y'all, I'm gonna let y'all check it out real quick, man. Let, let, let's stop. I'm gonna stop this music right here because I want to hear, I want y'all to hear, hear what shake, what my boy Shake is talking about, man. What he's talking about right now. I'm still using the cheesy behind he's the back. But that step back is a killer. Your, your ability. Look at the step back. Where you three. going? Um, bottom, bottom. I mean, you know, just to hit shot. That pump Actually, fake jump shot gives you a green yeah. release almost every time. Look at that. Let me try that one more time. Uh, pull pump up. fake. Put yes. it straight, trays up. Splash time. Y'all already see what time it is. Pump fake. Pump fake. Trays up. Pump fake. Pump fake. Splash time. I got mad space this time. Pump fake. Trays up. Splash time. Spin the rope. Oh, look at look at right Splash time. Right here, he's trying to Walking off. You guys are still on the fence. The doubters. We're going to try it as a whole team. Pump fake. Spin the rope. Spin the rope. Look at everybody pump faking like this bitch. Right here, I'm going to cook the young YouTube channel. Everybody is pump faking. But look, though. Um... Really, that is some validity to that. And let me tell y'all what the validity, what the validity is. My boy Gideon Prime was like, uh, two chases Gideon Prime. He was like, <laughs> he, he was not impressed. He just said, look, <laughs> this is evidence that 2K is really a, is is really an intense competition over who has the best grasp on shenanigans. The basketball is pure placebo. Oh, the basketball. Is pure placebo. Okay, I thought he was saying it, that the whole thing was placebo. But look though, the look man, the pump fake, why it works, a lot of y'all might not know why it works, man. The reason that it works is because um I told y'all in the video the other day that there are at least two releases <laughs> for everything. And um, I mean, you know, I there is at least two releases for everything. So when you when you pump fake it normalizes it and it makes you get the same release every single time and uh that's that's just really what it is um you get the same release every time and that's how nba 2k labs that's how they that's how they practice their jump shot they actually get it pump fake and then now you're going to get the fast release and then they just shoot it because there's at least two release speeds for every jump shot that's why that works like that so he said the basketball is pure placebo Hey, it is what it is, man. He ain't lying about that. Hey, I, I, I just can't. Oh, let me tell you, I miss. One hundred percent. I had to tell him he's right, one hundred percent. Anyway, but he's right. The basketball is pure placebo out here, man. And last but not least, so they did release the episode of um, you know. With, with my boy Buddy or what have you, man. He had, he had his episode. I'm not going to play it because they got music and you know 2K will copyright you. But you can go go over there, 2K uh, train, bro. Look at that dark fader. You're my boy T. Mizzle. Uh, you can see him. Look at Buddy. Okay, Buddy going to the rim a little bit. Buddy did his Make-A-Wish joint. And, uh, you know, they just they released the episode. And uh, he's the newest free agent. Uh, I wish I wish they would have put him in the game and made him a 99 overall or something and made him for his account so only he could play with him and then he could be cooking everybody else or at least give him like a million VC so he can get a whole bunch of bills and stuff like that. But hey, we don't know. Oh, he got the 30 carry jersey. I get to sit by running 2K and his parents, his, I think, I don't know if it was his mom or what have you, but she was in the deal and um, she was just saying, hey, it's awesome because he really likes, he really likes 2K. He really likes the game and all of that good stuff, man. And so they really, really made his wish come true with this, man. I think it's dope as hell. Regardless of how you feel about 2K, I think it's dope as hell that they help make my guy's wish come true. And um, I just think it's cool that, you know, that, that it's not always about making money. It's not always about basketball. It's not about that stuff, man. A lot of times it's just about doing what's right and, um, and all that good stuff. And they seem to have done that, man. But y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comments, man. Do y'all do the pump fake? Like, you can pump fake or you can just wait for a second. And like I said, when he goes here and puts the ball away, it's going to be the same type of release. 
it's gonna be the same thing. You probably gonna hit it damn near every time. So though, you want the fast release and without pump faking, you get the ball, wait till he brings it to here and then you can pull it and it's gonna give you the fast release every time. Otherwise, it's really up to the person that's passing. And the reason that a lot of people were saying that they've not, they haven't been using Dimer and stuff all year. The reason that Dimer changes your release, it doesn't change your actual release. What Dimer does in this game is it more often gives you the ball in shooting position. So you don't ever get the, you don't really ever get the slow release with Dimer. That's why you're always slightly late when somebody got Dimer. It, you catch the ball ready to shoot it when somebody passes you the ball with Dimer. So it's like, boom, and you're ready to shoot. That's why a lot of times you catch it and then you wait, and then you shoot it, you get the effect of Dimer. So you get the shooting boost of Dimer, but at the same time, you know, you're not, you, you, you get the, uh, you get your same slow release, your slower, I mean, you get your quick release or whichever release, you, you get to anticipate the release that you want, which is the, uh, which is the straight up release, but uh, the, the faster one, the one that's a little bit faster. But if you catch it with Dimer and then you get the fast release at the same time, it's really hard sometimes to anticipate. Like, it's like he just, ball just gone. But that's why that works, man. But you know, like I said, a lot of y'all said y'all turned off Dimer secretly a long time ago and Floor General and y'all been being selfish and saying, hey, if you can't shoot, you just can't shoot. You you know, it is what it is. Anyway, I got to get up out of here, man. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hey, hit the site up, get you some merch. We got tanks in the store now. Everything's going out today. If you order the shirt, the shirt is going out between today and tomorrow. And uh, that's it, man. I'm hollering to y'all next time. Till next time. That's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ. Godspeed. Wash your damn hands, man. It's so simple, my guy. And I'm out. Peace.